Here we go. The first event of News 9's new partnership with Sunbeam Family Services started just minutes ago. The campaign is called Building Brighter Futures. It's dedicated to helping young kids and their families thrive. News 9's Carl Torp live at the Sunbeam Family Resource Festival. Hey, Carl. Hey, Colby and Bobby. Yeah, it's a good time right here. This is Sunbeam's newest school, Edwards Early Education Center, Northeast 10th and Grand. They're having a festival here where families can come in here and uh, see what kind of resources are available to them. A little bit about this school, brand new, but basically this school was shuttered. Sunbeam came in, renovated the place, and now students are coming in here and families are getting a, a lot of help as well. Joining me, the CEO of Sunbeam, Sarah Rahal, and Sarah, let's talk about the festival today. What's going on? Oh, we are so excited for this partnership with you all. This is our family community resource festival, so the families can learn about all the partners that really want to be there to help them live their best life. And we're doing this until 7 o'clock. We are doing this till 7 o'clock. You're right. All right, let's talk about Edwards. This, this is an awesome school. It provides a whole lot of help. It's also a little bit different than your conventional school. Yeah. What can folks expect uh, here at Edwards if they decide to send their child here? All right, so we're going to be an early education center. We just got occupancy from the city. It'll take us a while to open, but we'll be serving families with a birth to three at this school in our classrooms. And then we're going to have space for community partners and mental health services also. And, and the classroom itself is a little bit different because students, they stay in there. They don't move classrooms as they move grades. Why is that important? Because they have the same teacher. They really develop a solid, safe relationship. And it's all about building their brain, which happens in a safe environment for birth to three. You have an amazing ratio when it comes to students to teachers. What, what is that ratio? It is two to eight. So two to eight. Two to eight. Uh -huh. Okay. And so, and for that reason, you guys, you guys need more teachers. We do. We need teachers, and we're hiring and we're providing um, training for teachers. So if you've never been one and you're interested, we'll we'll train you up. Okay. Very good, Sarah. We appreciate it. Thank you so much. We're excited about this partnership. We are too. We're here until 7 o'clock tonight at Edwards, but then tomorrow at Pierce Early Education Center, they're going to be having another one of these from 4 to 7 as well. Come on out. Also, if you want to help out the work that's going on at Sunbeam with these schools, please go to news9.com slash sunbeam if you'd like to donate. We'll have much more throughout our newscast this evening. Reporting live in Northeast OKC, I'm Carl Torp, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.